talk about single foot speed that and exercises that we can do to just improve that just naturally a little bit at a time little five minutes at a time before you do anything else if you're going to sit down and jump through your favorite song For one single pedal, it's always good to get your foot trained up as much as it can. Um, it can get you out of sticky situations in live playing. So there's a few exercises you can do that are very simple for 5-10 minutes at a time. Uh, just every so often, if you do them quite regularly, your foot will naturally just speed up a little bit. Uh, I, I like to play heel toe. If you have been looking all over YouTube, you'll see a multitude of different variations that people will tell you to play. Heel down, heel up, heel toe, slide. Um, side to side there's many and I'm not going to talk in detail about any particular one I personally like heel toe just because it works for me and that's why I wouldn't go into detail on them because every different technique works for one person or another and sometimes a technique just is no good for someone it's personal preference really you just really need to dig into one and try it if it doesn't work for you try something else if you play any of these exercises in your most comfortable way it doesn't need to be a specific heel toe or slide or swivel or anything like that if you just play it in your most comfortable way your foot will get faster uh, one exercise i like to do is doubles on my foot right left on my hand just move it about so at first you're going to want to stick to the snare and just bass bass right left bass bass right left bass bass right left bass bass right left <laughs> You can get that going and it's even is the main point then do it to a metronome you can get if you don't have a metronome you can get one and it's an app on your phone any phone they're all free um you can get one free on google just type in metronome google has its own metronome believe it or not and try it there see if you can speed it up slowly don't speed it up any more than five or ten beats per minute at a time because it's just going to get really sloppy really quickly and you'll wonder why you were really good a minute ago and you're really poor at it now you need to bring the increments up really slowly so try um, that until you can get a decent speed and once you can do that the the thing that's going to slow you down is this next step moving it about moving it about just working it around different drums right. once you can do that again you have to start that slow just because you're orchestrating about the kit you're, you're going to lose coherence of what you how your foot sounds once you can move that about slowly again just do it with a metronome and bring it up slowly you'll find if you stick nice and slow increments on the metronome your metronome your foot will uh, pick its own speed up eventually and uh, then another exercise i like to do is four with your hands so bass bass one two three four just because this can be used as actual fills um when you're playing if you if you're using it as a day-to-day -day exercise you could chuck that in as a fill you could quite easily do it because you have uh, been practicing it trying to do it at speed so a, a reasonable speed fill um, wouldn't be as fast as what you're trying to get your foot to go so if you practice this every day bass bass one two three four you're you're getting six you're getting six bass bass one two three four bass bass one two three four and then you're going to have to do Bass, bass, one, two, to make it 16. So if you play that. You're gonna have to play bass, bass, one, two, three, four, bass, bass, one, two, three, four, bass, bass, one, two, to, to resolve back into a normal bar of 16 notes. And then you can be moving that about. So there's a few combinations you could have here. You could have two, 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 or just four, and then four in the next one, two. So have it like that you could split them into twos you'd walk around the kit yeah so it, it's whatever different combinations there's millions then if you're quite sure of it you could split it up a bit so and if you as you speed these things up they get a little bit easier if you practice them enough so.
give them a go. The more you practice them nice and slow and slowly speed it up with a metronome, you'll get nice and smooth. See you next time.